to a story you saw first on seven. A South Florida firefighter in hot water after surveillance video appears to show him punching a patient in an emergency room. The firefighter accused of crossing the line and is now feeling the heat. Seven's Danielle Garcia is live outside of Jack's Memorial with the story you saw first on seven. Danielle. Yeah, that firefighter is now under investigation after punching that patient inside Jackson Memorial Hospital multiple times. But that firefighter is actually not the one who is under arrest. Watch as this Miami firefighter punches a man handcuffed to a stretcher. 7 News just got this video of the incident from mid-October, which happened inside Jackson Memorial Hospital. The patient was identified as Antonio Cruz, and according to this report, Cruz, who's homeless, was taken into custody for an unreleased reason and requested to go to the hospital after consuming cocaine and heroin. The report says that Cruz was, quote, agitated and screaming to the rescue personnel. That's when Cruz spit at the firefighter, who we're told is Robert Webster. The situation escalated when Webster punches Cruz several times, then the other rescue members doing everything they can to pull Webster away. After the incident, Cruz was arrested for aggravated assault on a law enforcement officer for spitting at that firefighter. And this isn't the first time that the firefighter, Robert Webster, has gotten attention. Several years ago, some of his colleagues were let go for hanging a noose over his family picture. They were also accused of drawing sexually explicit images on that family photo. Four firefighters were charged in that incident. And so the man who was punched is actually back in jail at this hour for petty theft and also another battery incident where he allegedly commit battery on another detainee. Meanwhile, as for Webster, the fire department says he has been relieved of duty pending an internal investigation. For now, I'm reporting live in Miami, Danielle Garcia today in Florida.